One of the best days out in London is to visit one of its museums. Many of them are free. Today we are rounding up five of the best. The National Gallery is an art museum in Trafalgar Square. The gallery houses the national collection of paintings in the Western European tradition from the 13th to the early 20th centuries. The collection belongs to the nation and is open to the public 361 days a year, free of charge. The nearest tube station is Charing Cross. The British Museum is a public museum dedicated to human history, art and culture, located in the Bloomsbury area. Its permanent collection of 8 million works is among the largest and most comprehensive in existence. It documents the story of human culture from its beginnings to the present. The nearest tube station is Holborn. The Natural History Museum exhibits a vast range of specimens from various segments of natural history. It is one of three major museums on Exhibition Road in South Kensington, the others being the Science Museum and the Victoria and Albert Museum. The nearest tube station is South Kensington. Interactive and thought-provoking, the Science Museum is a great place to see, touch and experience science firsthand. The museum curates a world-renowned collection and organises exhibitions and events for over 3 million visitors a year. The nearest tube station is South Kensington. The Victoria and Albert Museum is the world's largest museum of applied arts, decorative arts and design, housing a permanent collection of over 2.27 million objects. It was founded in 1852 and named after Queen Victoria and Prince Albert. The nearest tube station is South Kensington. Shame on you for not subscribing to our YouTube channel. It's Paul and Marcus, but you can still make it good. Just hit the subscribe button. <laughs> Just brushing up on how to subscribe to It's Paul and Marcus on YouTube. We hope that we have brought you some inspiration for a free day out in London this autumn. and the rest is drag. That's a popular saying that RuPaul will always say on her program. So Marcus got me this really interesting um, make your own drag queen and I received it um, as a gift and I haven't opened it yet. Wanna try adding your own photo so you can become a fabulous drag queen? I don't know about that, but yeah, maybe another time. Uh, so mold and shape the dough to create your fabulous queen. Choose a dress, pick a face, add the feather boa to make her even more fab. Work it, girl. All right, now let's... Let's look. So this looks like a wand, doesn't it? It you looks like one of too. those wands that you... Boom! Look at that. Look. It's a pointing stick if I go the other way around. Look, I can point. I am a big fan of Fred Bassett. Now, if you don't know who that is... I'm not sure who that is. He's this cartoon strip dog. And oh. he's appeared in the Daily Mail 
for many years. And it's the only part of the Daily Mail that I read, but you know, I'm reading that part of it.